Hello everyone, you're welcome to Jam Vibes. As far as Senzo Meiwa's case is concerned, so many things keep evolving on a daily, as allegedly, two men have finally come out to confess to Senzo Meiwa's killing, implicating Kelly Kumalo's family to a greater extent. Before I give you even more details about what is going on, kindly do all to follow Jam Vibes please. Like this video, drop a comment and most importantly, share this video to the ends of the world because you are creating awareness so people get to understand what is happening on ground. In a dramatic development, the prosecution in the Senzo Meiwa murder case has claimed that two individuals have confessed to the claiming of life of the former South African football captain. According to reports, these individuals allegedly pointed to Kelly Kumalo's family's home as the location of the fatal incident. The case has taken a surprising twist, prompting intense speculation and debate. Senzo Meiwa, a beloved figure in South African sports, was tragically ended in 2014 during an apparent home invasion. The case had remained unsolved for so many years, causing frustration and anger among the public. However, recent revelations have brought renewed attention to the investigation. The alleged confessions by these two men have ignited hopes of resolving the long-standing mystery surrounding Mayu's claiming of life. The details of their admissions as well as their potential motivations are still emerging, leaving many questions still left unanswered. Defense lawyers representing the accused individuals have responded to the prosecution's claims and a legal battle is expected as the case proceeds. As the public eagerly waits more information, the spotlight has turned once again to Kelly Kumalo's family's home where the incident was allegedly said to have occurred. The case has garnered intense media attention and scrutiny and has reignited discussions about justice, celebrity involvement and the effectiveness of the criminal justice system in South Africa. The revelations has brought both hope and skepticism and the path ahead remains still left uncertain. As the legal process unfolds, there is a collective hope that this new development will finally bring closure to Senzo Meiwa's murder case, providing answers to his family and the nation at large. The accused individuals and their alleged confessions are now central to a high-stakes investigation and the truth about what transpired that tragic day may soon be revealed one more time and given to the fact that it's been close to a decade but then again no truth has even been out yet concerning who is responsible for pulling the trigger on Senzo Meiwa this is a great step ahead. Everyone is really so excited and happy with the whole George Rata situation and being the presiding judge because given to the fact that when Judge Chifiwa Maumela was actually the one handling this, many were complaining that there is some level of bias, there's some level of scared nature, there's some level of you know truths being hidden from the people. But with Judge Rata, things have been moving just so fast. This breakthrough confession has actually broken so many people, but then again, actually posed some light on so many dark angles already, where so many were left in so much, you know, confusion about what actually went wrong that actually led to the passing away of just Senzo Meiwa in a house that had over seven people. This is so much in depth. Now, there is an in-depth glimpse of hope right now because the confession of these two people brings an insight of hope to the Mayuwa family and the entire South Africa at large, who have definitely been wanting justice for close to a decade right now. It marks a crucial advancement in the direction of finally solving the mystery behind Senzo Meiwa's claiming of life and holding those responsible accountable for their actions. The NPA has decided to pledge to conduct a thorough investigation in order to as well dot all the lines already and to link up all the dots to ensure that all these dots lead each and every person to the final truth, that truth that everybody wants to hear. The confession of these people represents a turning point in the Senzo Meiwa case, 
offering so much hope for a resolution that has eluded investigators for close to a decade. I want you all to now tell me in the comment section your honest truth about how you feel about this. I love you all so dearly. Do all to take good care of yourselves too, please.